Hello everyone, welcome back to Yakuza 0. Uh, yeah, last episode was crazy. Loved everything about the last episode. That was a lot of fun. Uh, this episode, if Kiryu would be so kind, we will... Kiryu? Please? I guess no smoke breaks. Smoking is bad for you kids. There's a Sega shop. Oh my god. <laughs> This is some. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I don't go too early. God. I'm so, so I'm actually throwing. Uh oh. Uh what the fuck? Aha. Now, grab the lizard. I want to please the lizard. No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> They're like. Ah. Oh. No, I'm trying again. I'm not giving up. I want something. Come on, grab one of the lizards. I beg of you. I might have made this too impossible. <gasps> Hold up. Yes, I got two! <laughs> I got two lizards! <laughs> Let's go! Okay, hold up. Let's try to get one of those ones. There we go. Ah, oh, no, too far. No! Wait! I think I got him. Let's go. A Gyonbo. Whatever that is. Okay, let's try to get the lady. This much? This much. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. I need. This is... I am... I am addicted now. Oh no. I never get to play these things IRL. Oh, wow, I missed that. Oh, Christ. Okay, I should go for the one either the furthest away? Oh, I can actually have a better view. It, it's... I, uh, I think I need to... Not this much. Come on. Come on, I just, w I just want this one and I'm gonna leave. Don't know! I had it! No, you're not giving up. I want it. Give me that horrible thing. I want it. Yes, okay, we got... Are you... Don't, 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 don't. I got it. Awesome. Well, we're done here. Oh. Change your four catcher prizes. What the fuck is that? Oh, the thing I did. Okay.
That was interesting. Oh my god, they actually have prizes. Oh my god, I... I'm sorry, I have to. Ah, oh, This is not gonna be fun, is it? Oh, come on, come on, come on, at least one of them. It's, I grabbed it by the tail again. God damn it. Ah, I would shut it a little bit. Hold on. Look at me. Am I gonna get the ball? E Z. That's a, that's a one star. Grab that one. I'm sure you can grab it. Oh. No. What? <laughs> Why? No, I'm not. No. No, 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 I, I, give, give me my squirrel. I have him, dead for rights. Oh my god, I missed. This is why I shouldn't live in Japan. This would happen to me. I would get stuck playing these fucking games. Because they're kind of the Loki addicting. Which is kind of the point, I understand. I missed completely. Well, unless I somehow grab this one. I just might. Nope, better than I said. God damn it. Come on, get that stupid squirrel. That should be it. Awesome. There we go. Acquired five different prizes. Yup. That was fun. Cool. I'm glad I did that. <laughs> I need to enjoy life before I go to prison. Let me... Let me quickly... Use the item box. No, I don't need all the duplicates. Do you have an infinite amount of space in it? Or is it limited? It might be limited. If that's the case, that's kind of sad. Nope. Uh, might as well save. Yeah, I would not survive a day in Japan. No idea what you would say, my friend. Popcorn shop. No, no let's not get distracted. Let's get... Let's... Uh, if there's a shop, I'll stop by it. Uh, to buy some, you know, healing supplies. Because they kind of came in clutch. You know who? Goons. Yeah. Oh my god, Kyrgyz! Holy shit! Also, I should spend my money, shouldn't I? Uh, hold on. Abilities. I like Brawler. A mighty knee strike unleashed from a low stance shot. Put your guard uh, right again. <laughs> Put up your guard again right after an enemy breaks through it. This ability can be used when calm on the first hit bar. Okay. Well, more HP doesn't hurt anyone, so. Let's get this. Uh, increase the power of your regular attack. Cool. You might as well. It's just more damage. Reduce the rate that hit cage drops over time. Yep, let's go with that. It's all about making us stronger. Reduce the amount of heat lost when you take damage from an enemy attack. That's fair. I'm vibing with it. And reduce the damage you take when thrown by an enemy. Awesome. Well, oh, there goes most of my yen. Can I put anything in here? Let's let's get this. I had of time. 
and this. I want to try and invest into everything possible. Oh wait, what's this? That's not the number I recognize, who is it? That's the Dojima family office number. The 49 in front means it's urgent. It's from Nikishi, it's code for what you up to. Okay, cool. Didn't know that was a thing. Weapon? Huh. Oh my god, what is this? Not gonna read. That's a lot of sub stories. Okay, cool. キリン。西木。お前大丈夫だったのか。これマジかよ。よく殺されなかったな。うん。なんだ。だがこれで俺はきっちり道島組を破門になった。そうか。それじゃ、親さんももう大丈夫ってことか。親さんのことはまだ。
Hmm. Good to know. <laughs> you're not half bad. I'll let you off the hook this time. What? If I'm having trouble with somebody like you, I need to change my training regimen. Time to bump up the intensity. It is going to be expensive. If I want to save up that kind of money, I've got some shaking down to do. Damn it! Get back here! Hey! You okay, man? Yeah. You just had the misfortune of beating Hiroya Igeshara. Mr. Shakedown, they call him. Mr. Shakedown? Yeah. He'll go after anybody that crosses his path, and then he takes everything they've got. You seem like you hold your own in the fight, but that guy's on a whole different level. If he sets his side on you, you run for it. He's definitely more than your average tough guy could handle. Still, I wish somebody would come along and beat all that stolen money out of him, though. What, did he get you too? Damn right he did. Took my whole holiday bonus. I knew I knew I should have made a bee line to the bank with it. You be careful too next time you're sitting on a stack of cash. Oh, and rumor has it Igashira is not the only Mr. Uh, Shakedown. And that they uh, that, and that they aren't just a Kamarucha thing. Stay sharp if you ever go out of town. Mr. Shakedown. Huh. He was insanely tough. I probably haven't seen the last of him, but I keep my eyes peeled. Mr. Shakedown won. If you lose to Mr. Shakedown in battle, he'll take all the money you have. If you spot him in the street, the safest tactic is to run away <laughs> before he can rope you into fighting. <laughs> if you can beat Mr. Shakedown, you'll reclaim all the money he's stolen from you. The amount he's carrying varies at different times. If you can take him down with his especially flush with cash, you can make back more than what you lost. Interesting. I should just head home for tonight. I really should. Why are you giving away pocket tissues? Is that, is that a normal thing that happens? Come on, Fox, come here. I'm in a bad mood. Okay, give me, show me the menu. This is the drink menu. Icy cold highball, most perfect with teriyaki. Masaki highball, enjoy the moment of full body flavor. Oh, long tea. And which ta takoyaki would you like? Absolutely tasty takoyaki. <laughs> I'll try this. The favorite is a crispy on the outside, but nestled inside is a firm, juicy nugget of octopus amid gooey goodness. Wow. I I guess I am, mainly because I'm not full health. Uh, let's go with this. Regular food sounds nice. And takoyaki. Cheese and spicy fish roll. This takoyaki is topped with melted cheese and our sp and our special spicy spicy fish roy mayo. It's our number one dish among the ladies. Oh, cool. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure I will. Okay. <laughs> oh my god.
It was all your fault. Feels like I haven't been home forever. Way too much has happened the last couple of days. Hey, what was that about? It is showing a bottle on my on my screen for some reason. Yep. You never know when tissues might come in handy. Oh, interesting. Okay. Cool. Uh, state of the art pager, okay. What is that bottle? What, what, what is that? Do you see that on the screen? What the fuck? And I'll, 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 I'll figure it out later, don't worry guys. Orda, Kiryu! ビール<笑> それまでは若頭補佐も ニュースになってる。会社の中で打ち殺されてたらしい。あの社長は風邪の指示でお前を空の一粒に呼び出したんだろう。多分風邪がその口封じに殺させたんだ。風邪は。あいつ。そんなに簡単に人を殺すのか
しかもそのほとんどを登場界の極道たちが仕切ってるだが立花不動尊はそのカムロ町の鉄の壁に穴を開けることができるんだ鉄の壁に穴を開けるどんなに繁盛してる店だろうが立花不動産が目をつけりゃ数日持たずに中の人間は追い出されちまう金脅迫嫌がらせヤクザ顔負けのやり口で店潰しちゃ空きになった不動産を転売するって話だたとえ登場界のケツ持ちと勝ち合おうがお構いなしにだわお今時の不動産周りは金の足掴み競争だ得体の知れない連中が群がってるけどその中でも立花不動産は札付きだ登場界本家も連中を排除しようと追ってるらしい本家かそのくらい厄介な連中ってことだけどそいつらがおめえの味方につくとなると面白くなるな信用できる相手ならの話だなんで俺を引き込もうとするのか立花の腹が読めねなら明日少し突っ込んで立花不動産を調べてみようぜ探ってみる価値はあるいや調べるのは俺一人でやるあお前が俺と一緒に動けば道島組に目をつけられるお前は関わるなキリュウ組抜けると決めた時から一人でやるのは覚悟の上だ I mean, as he said, he wants to take accountability. Oh, it's day. Maybe Nishiki's right, and I should accept the Shibana so far, but I need more to go on before I can trust him. I should hit the town to see what I can find about him. Gabba Rivo on Nachiban. Nachiban real estate. I'm bummed that Cafe Blend closed all of a sudden. Them being open all night was a huge deal. You heard anything about it? Think the guy running the place just kept down? Nah, they just moved shop. They're across from Match Ball behind Theater Square. There's a new sign up. Oh, really? But wait, why bother moving if it's only a few blocks away? They got chased off by those guys that she found the real estate. I hear they didn't leave one guy much choice. Same with all the other tenants in that building. The lot of them either moved shop or shut up for good. Whoa, seriously? Well, that's a relief. I guess I'll have to hit them up behind Theater Square next time. Oh, we got some information. The asteroid belt. Hi! Oh. Hey, Kiryu-san! Hmm? Mm, well, if it isn't Kamoi. Thanks again for before. So this is where you do your thing, huh? I punch out artist, was it? Yup, that's right. That's me. That's my job. I couldn't make much sense of Bacchus's explanation. What is it you do exactly? Oh, rules are simple. You knock me down or knock me out and the prize money is yours. Price is double the stakes. Customer puts up 10,000 and if they win, I give them 20,000. Half, uh, half of that be upfront fee. So we only need we only needs to fork over the other half. Pay Kamoi an amount equal to the entry fee in advance. This limit is 60 seconds. If you get knocked down or knocked out, you lose. If you hit the, the challenger, you also lose. Mm. So people who actually put money on this. Frustrated drunks, they, uh, they, uh, Days your best bet, come at you in a nice straight line, easy to dodge, punches are garbage too. I do this to everyone I see. So mo most challengers are, are guys looking to blow some steam by hitting someone, and not tough guys looking to win some cash, huh? Uh-huh. Oh hey, if you was interested, why don't try it out? We could bill you as my apprentice. Why would I want to be your apprentice? True this, nobody's ever took me down before. Words getting, uh, words getting around, so I get more gawkers and less challengers. But with an apprentice, I reckon that that would change. They would want to see if they could take you on, so I'd get tons of challengers again. Makes sense, but I don't take too kindly to being made uh, anyone's apprentice or pupil. I told Pakus the same. 
Well, if I has any pointers to give you, I'll be sure to let you know. I make a pretty good teacher. Strange guy, but this Kamoji seems like the real deal. I could learn more about that fighting style. Sure, why not? Tell me, tell me how this goes. Alrighty, check out the, uh, this price list. Customers get to choose any of the courses. One million yen. Some of these are pretty pricey. Mm. Uh, plenty of people rolling in cash around here, so I figured I might get lucky. One guy picked the million yen course once. Ah, uh, all very well if you win, but you have to pay out if you lose, right? That's a pretty big gamble. Hey. Yeah, that's why I turned down the million yen guy. He looked a bit too tough to, uh, to risk it. <coughs> then why even have those courses? It attracts challengers. No way a homeless guy uh, the likes of me could pay out, right? Anyways, you don't seem too keen uh, to earn that way, so Bacchus's plan sounds best. Bacchus had a plan. What was it? We start by looking for a 10,000 uh, 10, yen mark, and then if that works out, we shoot for ten, uh, 100 yen. Dodge our way through another bout, and we set our sights on a cool million. He's dreaming if he thinks that will work. I suppose 10 million yen and 100 million yen would be next. No way anyone will take you up on that bet that mm -hmm. high. Never know though, right? Don't knock it if you uh, and don't knock it until you try it. So who pays out the prize money? You, of course, Kirison. Got to make sure you're covered if you ever lose. Uh, if everything goes smooth, the the money will come flying in. Fine. Alrighty, let's start with the 10,000 course yen. Just give me a shout when you're all ready with the money. Don't slack off of your training, neither. Um. I mean, let's give it a try. You ready with, with the money and all? Yep. <sighs> you want to create your boots to select the price. The sprite though. Create your lush, or rush style abilities after abilities in the pause menu. You don't get some more training in, you might as well fold that money into paper planes, but in a little effort, hmm? Okay, so I'll be back with you later. <coughs> cool. So we can learn from him. Okay, wha what did I say? I don't remember the exact wording they said. Oh, does it not show on the map? Uh, give me a second. Theater Square. Yeah, it's... Yeah, this thing. Okay. Bowling. I do like bowling. So, do I need to go that way? Yeah, that way. Cool. I'll be back with you guys. I, I use shout. You're lying! Hmm? You're hiding something from me, aren't you? Hmm. Calm down, Tat Chan. I I'm not hiding anything. I'm sorry, but Mina Chan, I saw inside your purse. It was full of money. That that's there had to be like a 200 200k yen in there. Mina Chan, your family isn't that rich. What's going on? How dare you poke around in my purse? Tat Chan, you're a jerk. I hate you. Mina Chan. I mean, you are a jerk. Uh, for a spat between a high school couple, that was pretty raw. Oh, what's wrong, lad? Oi! Oi. Huh? What? Who, who are you? Yeah. Nobody special. I overheard your spat and didn't like what I was hearing. Uh, yeah, we were really going at it there, huh? I'm sorry if, if, it made, if we made you uncomfortable. And that girl, Mina, is my girlfriend. But she's been acting strange lately. Strange how? All of a sudden, she started turning me down a lot. We almost never go out on dates now. Well, you guys are young. There must be a lot, a lot on her mind. Sure, if that was all, I, I could understand. But she's also been really, she's been really throwing a lot of money around lately. And on the rare occasion that we go on a date, she always wants to go buy lingerie by the back. Hmm. I got suspicious and went through her purse. I found at least 20, uh, 10,000 yen notes in it. 200, uh, 200k yen. Unless your mina is from a very wealthy family. That sounds fishy. I worry that mina is selling herself. Selling herself? Whoa, whoa. Isn't she still in high school? Yeah, but wouldn't that explain why she's always loaded and buying new lingerie? Mm. Lingerie. Hmm, that's hard to say. I know. Would you mind checking up on Mina for me, just to find out what she's up to? Nani. What? No, what? Why me? Well, if I had to see Mina selling herself, it would scar me for life. 
I can understand that, but please, I'll give you some kind of reward. Please find out what Minachan is doing. Oh, okay, I'll do it. All right, fine. I'll go check on her. You, you will? Uh. Yeah. I kind of want to know why a girl would be carrying around that kind of catch myself. Oh man, I hope she's not selling herself to sleazy geezers. Minachan hangs out around Sendrio Avenue a lot. Please, pl please find, uh, please find out what she's up to. Sendrio Avenue. Got it. Do we want to go on a little side quest? It won't take us long. I don't think. Where is Sandrio Avenue? Kamuro, Little Asia. Oh, there we go. Oh, that way. I mean, might as well, you know, experience a little bit of the side quest. Like this, this one. Yeah. A moment, please. Mm hmm. What is it? Can I ask you a few questions? Ah. <sighs> Stop and search, huh? What's your name? And what do you do for a living? Fine. The name scare you. I'm in a hurry here. Well, we've had some trouble around these parts lately. Just to be sure, would you mind if I checked your belongings? What have my things got to do with, uh, with any trouble around here? Relax, it's just a precaution. Can, can you show me what you're carrying? Ugh. This could take forever, I might as well show him what I have and get this over with. Okay, you win, I'll show you. Then. What should I hand over? How about this? Huh. This is about as safe as it gets. It doesn't look like you're carrying anything dangerous. Here, take this back. Uh. I've got nothing to hide. <laughs> I see, well, thank you for your cooperation. Give me a break. Cops like you are always abusing your power. You, n you never stop to think about how much of an inconvenience this is for a regular yeah. citizen. Well, that may be so for other police officers. Not for me, though. I'm only doing this because it's all I'm good for. Mm -hmm. Huh? What, 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 what do you mean? Oh, never mind about me. I'm the one asking the questions here. Huh? Don't make sense. I was sure you had something big on you. I've got the nose for these things. <laughs> Well, I guess your nose failed you this time. I'm not so sure. My sixth sense tells me I'll find something huge if I dig deep enough. I don't know what to say. I'm a broad, st uh, I'm broad stop, uh, stop and searches until I'm sure you're not a threat. I'm going to keep questioning you, okay? Not okay. Oh, come on. Curious son. Be a good sport. It won't take long. I just want to be sure. I give up. Fine. Have, have it your way. Just keep it short. Alright, thank you. My name is Officer Kikuchi. I'll see you around then. <laughs> Friendship? You get to know Officer uh, Stop and Search Kikuchi. Interacting with him will gradually fill the friendship uh, gauge. You can check the status of the gauge at any time in the post menu's completion list. Build your uh, friendship with Officer Kikuchi and see what happens. Okay, can we talk right now? I'll see you for another Stop and Search soon, Kirisan. <laughs> Fine. Where could that young miss be? Well, I think I passed her. Yeah, he said she should be here. But she isn't. So I'm guessing she might be here at night. That's my guess. Unless she's in the pool, but I doubt that. Oh. Yes, 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 I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm sorry, I learned my lesson. You show those bugs. Thank you. It isn't much, but please take this. You got a slightly battered ruby plate. <laughs> that is high value. Uh, that is more assholes. 
Uh, it's fine. Calm down, you sissies. <laughs> What's here? I guess I'll sit over, over there today. Uh, why? Word of, word of advice, you'd better not sit there, buddy. Uh -huh. Is this seat reserved? Something like that. Besides, why I hide in the corner? Come on, come on over. Let's lift the glass over or free. Yeah. Oh, sure. Come on, Ruchi on the cover. <laughs> you sure can pound him. Looks like you can hold your liquor. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like you could hold your own in a fight too. Mind tell me how you make uh, make your living. Mm. Hey, you don't have to say if you don't want to. Just you know, curious. Yeah. No, it's not that. It's a little complicated, but I had to go straight recently. I had to go straight, eh? So it used to be. Boss man, the usual. Hey. Of course, right away. That's the seed that was just... Shh. Mm -hmm. You seem a little oblivious, so let me bring you up to speed. The guy who just came in? Whoa, don't look now. He's a mobster. Is that right? Huh? You're not vase in, like, in the least. Well, I suppose that makes sense. You being ex Yakuza, though. No? From the information that appears together, he waits there for customers to come to him and buy weapons. Weapons? Ah. Yeah, guns smuggled in from China, chipped to source, and wove a bundle selling to Japanese. How do you know all this? <laughs> I'm a journalist. You know, the magazine, weekly sh Shinjutsu. I write for them. Yeah. No, can't say I do. So you're a journalist. The name's Kasuga. I'm Kiryu. Kiryu-kun. Huh. There, there, it's in the memory bank now. See, I'm investigating the dark side of Kamarucho. This town's teeming with shady characters. I want to get to get the inside scoop and blow the covers, the covers clear off. The dark side of Kamarucho. Huh. I'm not sure that's a good idea. One full step and you could find your, uh, yourself in way over your head. <laughs> <laughs> it's no problem. I've been through wars. I know when to hold them and when to hold them. Barkeep, whiskey and water. Hey. Right away, sir. Bossman, I'm stepping out for a minute. Certainly. See? They go out together and he sells his guns. I see. For my story, I need a sense of gritty realism. I need to get to, uh, get close to the action. You know, that means taking risks. So here's my plan. I'm going to try buying a gun from Ready? Mm, what? Anyone can just walk up and buy ah. a gun? Yeah, if you sit next to him and order whiskey and water, supposedly. That's the signal. Oh, yeah. The guy earlier ordered the whiskey and water too. I was skeptical at first, but now I'm convinced. I'm going to take a shot at it. Not today, but Oi. soon. Not good. Can uh, No good can come from a civilian striking a match on the criminal affairs. Play with fire and you'll get burned. <laughs> You're worried for me? Appreciate it. Maybe next time I can interview you, Kirikon. I'm in. I'm here if I'm in the mood. Hey, don't be that way. Tell you what, though, let's drown our sorrows here again at some time. Except next time we drink on your tap, Kirikon. <laughs> in the turn, I'll tell you some stories you wouldn't believe. Mm, I mean, sounds good to me. Looks like a oh, doggy. Can I play? No, oh, that's so sad. And there was one more sh shop here. Sorry, my pro just felt like putting out. I'm guessing this is another bar, something. Oh, Earth Angel. You got the Miko Abena Type A card. What the fuck is this? A telephone call? What? Yes, Hello, sir. what would you like? Order. What do you what do you have? I that's too bad. We'll take care of come again soon. Uh-huh. 
fascinating. Is, is that all you can do here? This is the bar where I met Kasuga, the reporter investigating Kabrucha's dark side. Uh, can I help him? Kasuga's here, I'll let him tell me one of his stories. <laughs> can I order whiskey and water? No, I can't. Kasuga's here. Guess I'll say hello. Barkeep, whiskey and water. Hey. Yes, uh, coming right mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. Whiskey and water. The guy next to him is the gun dealer. To let him, uh, to let him know you want a gun, you sit next to him and order whiskey and water. That's uh, that's how it went last time. Kasuga must be making his move right now. Horseman stepping out for a bit. Are you a reporter? Uh -huh. huh? Your writing is a dead giveaway. Besides, you've been snooping around for a while, sneaking glances my way. No, uh, I haven't. Shut your hole. We'll see if you have to sing a different tune mi minus a few white and uh, white and pearlies. Follow me. Well, now he's done it. I told him to stay out of it. Guess I can't ignore this. Honestly, I'm not a reporter. Help! I'm a sick of clowns like you. Got no choice but to make an example of you, so the next Joker thinks twice. Good. That's enough. You were in the bar too. What's it, what, what's it to you? He's my sworn brother. You mind backing off? What? Sworn brother? Then he's not a reporter? Well, at least you're no civilian. Hmm, fine. I'll take your word for it. If you can prove it with your fists. What? How's about that? Fits don't lie. Satisfied? You'll back off now? Fair enough. I deal's a deal. Seriously? Then listen about that gun. Sell me a oh. firearm. Hey, Kasuga. Heh, <laughs> you got nerve. I like that. I usually don't deal with first timers, but I'll make an exception this time. <laughs> yes, score! You see, he actually buy a gun. Oh, Kirikon is safe in there. Uh, thanks, man. Go on now, drink up. It's on me. Kasuga, you got balls getting the deal done after that hairy start. That's some nerve. <laughs> That's the least of what it takes to chase down that, uh, what my readers want. Thanks to you, I gotta kill a story. How about Up in Arms? A frightening first hand focus on the strict deadliest dead dealers. Sounds exciting? But I hope our new friend doesn't read your story. <sighs> now, what to do with this, little toy? No, nowhere I can dump Daddy. it. What? After all that effort, you're ditching the gun? Well, sure. I mean, I'm a law-abiding <laughs> citizen. All I need is a story. The pen is mightier than the gun. Mm. I also don't get what uh, what makes a journalist tick. <laughs> Alright, how about I gift, it, gift this to you? As your reward. I get this feeling you're just dumping it on me, but okay. Gratefully accepted. Thanks. You got a 9mm automatic pistol. <laughs> I'm gonna take a screenshot of that. Well then, what shall I write about next? Even after that scare, still no lesson learned, huh? You know I can save your ass every time, right? <laughs> Thanks for the warning. But this is who I am. Once I catch the wind of a new story, there's no stopping me until it's old. If another, if another juicy art article starts brewing, I'll fill you in on the scoop. O over a couple drinks, naturally. <laughs> Ever the fearless reporter. Still, there's a lot even I don't know about the dark side of Kamarucho. Kamarucho is scarier place than I imagined. Awesome. Well, I, I have a gun now. How do I use it? <laughs> this is a gun in common circulation among the instance of the underworld. So I can shoot people now. 
Okay, clearly this whole thing is a pass until the lady's round. So we'll come back a bit later. I wanna shoot you. I wanna shoot you anyways. How do I come? Okay, that's funny. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Okay, let's go to the thing now. Because, what's this? Oh, this is Sandria Avenue. Oh, no. Ah, we'll do that later. Uh, let's focus on the main story for a little bit. Oh. What the fuck? Hmm? <laughs> Yikes! Oi. Hey, you alright? Huh? Uh? Man, oh man, I figures I would bump into, uh, into some swaggering punk. Oi, oi, you are an uh, old man. This isn't going to end well. Are you alright? Uh, no, what's the big idea, yo? I'm sorry, uh, <laughs> watch, watch where you step, shit for brains. You're not hurt or anything, are you, asshole? Alright, if that's how you want this to play yeah. out. What? Yep. I'm so sorry! No, I mean, I'm, I'm, in a, I'm in a rush, you see, so please get lost, you punk ass so and so. What? <laughs> what? What What just happened? Damned Yankee. <laughs> what? <laughs> We're not doing this right now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Shut your whole fat ass and open your wallet. Whoa. What? Uh -huh. I'm telling you, I can't pay. I'm dead broke right now. Don't give me that bullshit, Dubs. I watched your sorry ass come out of that soap plant last night. What? Yeah, then you marched your little bodies around from club to club, drinking till dawn, living pretty large for a broke guy, ain't ya? You? you were spying on me? You're goddamn right. You know how many different leaders you, you've dicked over, pork chop? It's collection day, and your ass is getting beat. A female collections agent. Pretty unusual. Sounds like a real bullbuster, too. <laughs> She's terrifying as ever. Marcus? What? She's a friend of yours. You got that right. Sure wouldn't make an enemy of her. That's where Miss Tatsu, the debt collector, she's a legend in Yokohama. Miss Tatsu, huh? She takes on the jobs that make other collection boys run away crying, and she always, always gets the cash. Her style is bold, blunt, and brutal. Add to that, bu uh, add, add, uh, add that to your bulldog's own tenacity, and you, uh, and you get one mean bite, my boy. You seem awfully familiar with her methods. This is the voice of personal experience. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you got me, boy. I was this close and in my face came in over a silly little depth a while back. Why am I not surprised? Hey, look there, boy. We're about to see what makes our lady Miss Tatsu so incredible. Huh? Huh? You think you can get the money out of me? I'd like to see you try. <laughs> you boy, you boys and your tiny toys. You think your little banana knife there is going to stop me? <clears throat> Drop the tough act, sugar tits. I put a dozen dudes in the hospital with this baby. If you have a tear stained apology, tear stained apology ready for me, though, I'll hear it out. That's my line, sugar moves. Except, uh, except the part about hearing you out, since you'll be too dead. Now make your move. Ah, uh, pulling a weapon on a woman. That's going too far. I'm stopping this. No, no need, boy. Just wait. Mm -hmm. No blinking now, boy. Keep those eyes on Miss Tatsu and showtime. <laughs> That's right. 
<laughs> what the fuck? That's awesome. What the fuck? Whoa, those moves. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like that beat gave you a few ideas. Uh, yeah, more than a few. Oh, yeah. Fantastic, boy. Hope you're ready to put that, that put them into practice. Mm. Huh? What? Look over, over yonder. Looks like you're a bad guy. Here's got some friends. Oh shit! Jenkins getting beat to hell. He paid the tab last night, so what say we pay him back by sucker punching this crazy bitch for him? Hear that, boy? Those dim bulbs are planning on getting the drop on the little lady from behind. Sounds that way. Lovely crowd. They're perfect match for the sort of scum that pull a knife a woman. Why don't you give him a, a little demo of what a man's supposed to be? I'm now saying this doesn't involve you yeah. this time. I wouldn't. She can clearly defend herself, but there's a whole pack of them. I'm jumping yes. in. Yes, that's my boy. Keep surely alive and walking in a fine bit of training in the process. Haha! <laughs> the hell do you want? Oi. You guys planning to suck a punch that woman in the back? You got an eavesdropping dropping problem? And then straight we are. You think I want that psycho bitch to see me coming? We'll drop her before she can get those claws out. I don't care how tough she is, I, you don't hit a woman. And needing a group to do so is just pathetic. You call yourself man. <laughs> I'm screaming shit like that. Uh? The fuck did you say? You got a big mouth and a death wish, pal. Yo, we're dropping this guy before we take take uh, take care of the road. Road. You are all dead. Switch to B style. You can switch to B style by pressing. Uh, okay. <laughs> While near a large weapon, showing mark near the weapon, pick it up, swing it. This is called an auto weapon. <laughs> Holding to guard lets you send any attacks with the resist guard, you will take a certain amount of damage, but you are protected against Attacks coming from any direction, bolstering the defense by clicking gear in the. Oh my god! Use beast move to pulverize this pack of cowards. Oh no! Oh. Jesus! Kitty, you just killed that man! What is this guy? All of us beating on him and it's like he doesn't even feel it! You want more? Uh, I'm living till I at least punch that up at the bitch. Well, 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 if it isn't Porky's little friends. I saw you I saw you boys scrolling the bars last night. Uh But I must be hearing things, because it sounds like you said something about pinching a bitch out. If you're interested, this bitch is ready to go. Uh, no, 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 no ma'am, that's just crazy. What kind of a man would punch a lady and for group? So pathetic. <laughs> Right, now pick up that sad sack lying over there. Uh, over there and get the hell out of my sight. I get what I came here for. Got no use for him now. Yes, ma'am. Bacchus, been a while. Yeah. Mm, same, same old miss that's so strong as a pound barrels. You're the one to talk, old man. So, can I introduce me to my knight in shining, shining armor here? What? Oh, right! This here's my latest find, a real diamond in the rough. Name skew you. 
Kiryu, huh? I remember the name. If you've got Bakus singing your praises, you have gotta be pretty yeah. tough. He is. This boy is here as a future champion. I'd, I'd stake my career on it. Ah, okay. Now I'm seeing what this is. You're thinking Kiryu here is your ticket to a fat stack of cash, which you'll then use to pay me back so we can we, we get to stay friends. <laughs> Easy, Taiga. I told you'd take a while, but you'll get uh, you'll get it all back. Oh, and speaking of famous, why don't you train the boy here? Wait, what? Do I seem like the patient teacher type thing? Sorry, no can no. Nah, no, don't be like that. We both need him to be stronger. Once he's a champ, we'll be rolling in dough. Besides, I know you're secretly the doting type. He'll make champ. Uh, he'll make champion a hell of a lot faster with you beating him into shape. That means you get paid. So that see, win, win, and win. Oi. Marcus, what do you think you're doing here, man? Yeah. Negotiating an apprenticeship with Miss Tatsu for you, obviously. Trust me, you train under her, you'll be master of the ring in no time uh. flat. You're insane. I'm seriously hot water right now. I don't have time to humor your little fantasies. What? You're in hot water too, my boy? Are we talking knife in the ribs here? Because I warned you about that. I'll be lucky if that's all I get. And seriously, what's this obsession with me getting stabbed about? Alright, chuckleheads. That's enough. Neither one of you is making a damn bit of sense. But I hear where you're coming from, Bacchus. Ditch the championship talk and just say you care about the skill you get. If you worry about him, own it. Mm. Look, you did me a solid a minute ago. I can do this. Besides, the old man is right that my training will make a real man out of you. Mm. Hop a cab out to the pier sometimes. I've got a training space there. You train at the pier? You got it. Kinda, uh, kinda live there too. Pay me a visit sometimes. See for yourself. I think you like the digs. Anyway, that was my last job in the city, so I'm headed back to base. Kiryu, you, me, peer, training. I'll be waiting. That just happened. Bakos, I've already got a future planned. I'm sorry, but I can't be your champion. What sport are we even talking about? Boxing? Not that it matters, I can't. Oh, I know that. Doesn't mean I'll stop trying. Mm. But I know when to stop making a nuisance of myself. I'll give you some space, champ. It's about time for my afternoon drink anyway. Help me clear my head. Good luck with that. Just don't have too many. Yeah. <laughs> you think a, cold, a guy called Bacchus can hold his wine? Ha! See you around, boy! Keep those ribs knife free now. Cheerio! Get out of here. And thanks. I'll be careful. Didn't expect to get wrapped up in that mess, but at least it didn't come away empty-handed. Now, back to, to looking for leads on Tachibana real estate. Yeah, back on that. Took a little detour, I suppose. Oops, wrong way. So is there an entrance through here? Hey there, buddy. Been looking for you. Uh, you again? You got a lot of nerve showing up now. What do you want? I think it's pretty clear what I want. Time to pay your protection money, pal. You're doing business at Gamarucho, you're doing business with us. To hell with that. It's not pr protection money if you don't show up to actually protect me when I need it. And you have to gal just for more. When you need it? What are you talking about? I'm talking about Tachibana real estate. When they came and chased me out, you people know inside some protection. Tachibana. What? Oh, Tachipan Real Estate. Yeah, there. Look, <sighs> it's complicated. Complicated, my ass. You got you got scared and run away. What could my what could be simple? Sc scared? <laughs> Who do you think? Thanks to you, I had to relocate. Now I'm scrambling to get new customers to make up for all the ones I lost. I couldn't pay you even if I wanted to. I think you better keep that attitude check, asshole. Mind if I cut in? Huh? What do you want? Who are you? What family are you with? I'm not in anybody's family. And pipe down. It's this guy I'm talking to. Excuse me? What, what do you want from me? You say you opened up shore, uh, shop here because the Shibana real estate forced you out of your last location. That right? Oh, I see what this is. You're trying to beat this guy's new muscle. Oh, hell no. What? 
Our family's handled this capacity protection for 30 years. You try to sweep in on, the tur on our turf, it will mean war. Looks like you need some convincing to stay quiet while I speak with the owner here. Shut your mouth and try me, I'll kill you. Yeah, but I have something for you. Oh shit. Hold on, I need to stop senses. <laughs> Get out of here. What the hell? I'm not losing to some kid. I don't remember what the voice was doing. You just did. Now get lost and don't show your face around this guy's shop again. Damn it. This ain't over. There. Now we can finally talk in peace. So. What? In the end, you're just, you're just taking his place as the guy squeezing me for protection money. Please, can you just leave me alone? I already said it wasn't like that. I'm not even Yakuza. I really just want to talk for a minute. Talk about what? That you bought the real estate. I'm doing a little investigation and I'd like you to tell me what you know. Anything is fine. What I know isn't a hell of a lot or a lot. Besides, I'd prefer now to deal with those guys again. They're terrifying. Terrifying how? What did they do to you? It's not even what they did, they just knew about me, like, everything about me. Like what? My parents' home address, my daughter's school, where I source all the cafe supplies, who all my customers are. With that much ammo, they didn't, they didn't have to do anything. And to pop it off, they're not even Yakuza, at least that lot. You know what to expect. I see. And where would I go if I want to meet the guy from Tachibana's office who paid you that visit? They're probably still there, finishing what they started. Still where? The Hakua building on Shichifuku Street. The place my cafe York was in. They've driven most of the tenants out, so the place is practically empty. But there was one stubborn guy who said the only way he was living was in the casket. And he's still there. Probably. They were making him all kinds of sweet deals, but he turned down every last one. If he's still there now, the Chibana's boys will be too. Go, have a look if you really want to get mixed up with them. Alright, thanks. I appreciate it. The Chibana's been running tenants out of the Hakua building on Shichifuku Street. It's worth checking out. Thanks, dude. We'll do the side quest later. Let's do... let's just... Mm -hmm. Oh, god damn it. Oh well. What's going on? This is a rough looking crowd. <laughs> I'm so freaking stoked, man! A rare street show, uh, a, a rare street show by, uh, by the Yakomochi ah. Silvers. It's you right, those guys are rock and roll gods. Look at this bitchin' crowd. <laughs> they bitchin'. They drew off his punks without any ads uh, or anything. Crazy Q on the Yokomichi Silvers fucking rule! And keep your pants on. I heard the Yokomichi Silvers are gonna hold a QA panel eh? too. No effing way. They're famous for never saying a word and letting their music do the talking. I wonder what the hell they'll talk about. Sounds like some bands doing an event here. Must be popular with the local punks. Mm hmm. Is that. I, as I said, we'll talk to him later. Should we now? Oh. Ah, let's do it now. Why not? <sighs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh, look at those people, at these people. Holy cow, what are we going to Oi. do? Hey, you. Yikes! <gasps> Jeez, whiz pal, I nearly beat my. Uh, what, what, are you what are you doing shuffling around behind me, you ugly knob? Uh, yeah, sorry, I thought I should apologize for bumping you into you earlier. Oi, who? Oh, you're that man! No, I should be apologizing for my girl. I mean, whatever. Piss off! Uh, um, sure. Hmm? Oh? Wait a second. Could you possibly be unaware of who I am? Hmm? 
Are you asking if we met before? We bumped into each other. If we did, I don't recognize you. Oh, wait a second then. So, you really don't know who I am? Willikas, what a relief. Huh? I'm sorry, I was rude not to introduce myself. My name's Kyo, but my stage name is Crazy Kyo. I'm the vocalist in the band. Let me guess, the Yorkimochi Silvers. The same band is the same band those punks w uh, are excited to see. Aren't you guys some kind of legendary Yankee band? Yes, that's us. We're doing a street show here later. Oh, sorry to bug you before you show. Good luck. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell do you think you're going, old man? Uh, wait, please, sir, don't go. Mm -hmm. Maybe, maybe you can save me? Save you? Nani? What? Are you, are you, are you in hardcore in the slightest? Nope. As a joke, we tried dressing all punk at the show. To our shock, we are pretty popular with the Yankee crowd. <laughs> but now we have to keep our, uh, keep up this shroud full time. Over time, we gained a fan base of wannabe punks and uh, the Yakamochi Silos became heroes to the rebellious youth of Japan. The whole style is called Yankee now. Mm. And there's more to running a band than I thought. So, what did you mean by saving you? I, um, actually... I want you to teach me how to be a hardcore hooligan. <laughs> Nani? Teach you? To be a Yankee? Yes, you see, for today's events we also have to do a live panel, a meet and greet for the fans. But every member of the Yukamochi Silos, myself included, are law-abiding choir boys. <laughs> We've never even shoplifted. If we were to talk in front of a real Yankee, they'd realize we're phonies. Fake punks, eh? Now that you mention it, the way you talk doesn't match how you dress at all. Right, so if we spoke to our fans, we would lose all our credibility and popularity in an instant. Or worse, what, uh, what if they want to mention us for fooling them? I don't think they care, because they're just, they just like your music. Uh, okay, but do you have to do this panel thing? Why don't you just skip it? I don't want to do it either. But our agent says we need to hone our speaking skills if we want to stay popular. They're making us do this. We've been avoiding every situation where we might have to talk instead of just performing. But now... Got it. So you want me to teach you how to behave like a Yankee so you can talk like one. But why me? Why? Well, that, because you're my, you're my ideal of what a hooligan should be. That confident demeanor, your razor shop color, <laughs> the barbed wire attitude that says touch me and get cut, and yet you also execute, exude a sense of kindness, a guy who extends a helping hand to the weak, the hooligan with a heart of gold. That's my ideal Yankee. Well, yeah, I am a Yakuza, kind of. <laughs> you can teach us how <laughs> so we don't blow our cover. More than that, I think you can give us Yankee wisdom that people that will propel the Yamakashi Silver to new heights of hooliganism. Please, if you lose this chance, the Yokomuchi Silos may have to break up. Please teach me how to carry myself like a true Yankee. Sure, why not? Okay then, I'm not sure how useful I can be, but I'll try. <gasps> really? Thank you so very much! Oh, I'm so sorry, I didn't catch your name. It's Kiryu. Okay, okie dokie, Kiryu-san. Give me just a second, please. I'll get. I'll go get the others. Sorry to keep you waiting, Kiryu-san. This is our drummer, Sleazy Tarashi. Hi. Hey there, I'm Tarashi. My strange name is Sleazy, but uh, stage name is Sleazy, but I have no experience with the ladies. Never seen a, <laughs> never seen a boob. <laughs> this is a bassist, bad boy Aku. I'm Aku. Ho uh, hope he's caring for elders. And this is Kiryu, uh, this is Kiryu san, who's going to impart the ways of true Yankee style hooliganism to us. Please teach us, Kiryu san. Uh, you guys are so polite and proper. I'm starting to wonder if there's anything I can do for you. <laughs> oh no! Please don't say that! We're all pretty good guys at heart, so please help us! In, in your case, being pretty good guys is the problem. But I did agree to do this, so somehow we have to turn you into guys... Guys... Wait, turn you guys into hard-edged punks. <laughs> oh yeah, please! Hmm, how can I show you guys how to be tougher, though? Hmm. Well, maybe you could uh, come, up, uh, come up with an opening remark for little old me. Your opening remark? Yeah, I want to kick off our panel with our authority. Being hooligans, we shouldn't come across as weak or hesitant. Please, curious son. I need a singer of an opening line to set the tone. They're below the gallery today. Start your engines.
I'm trying to think, what would the punk say? Why not open with statue engines? Statue engines? Oh, like a rushing uh. them. Right. The Yankee movement is inspired by Western greasers. They love their wheels. So true. That does go with the Yankee lifestyle, so I should follow with something like, You got my pistons pumping, don't you think? <laughs> That's good. It, w it wouldn't hurt to throw in something like ram, I ram it into overdrive, Eva. <laughs> right, right, I didn't know about that one. I'm so glad we got your advice, Kyrie-san. Oh, oh, oh uh, Kyrie-san, question. Mm -hmm. What is it? Well, the agency told me to tell the fans about how I spend uh, how I spend my days off when I'm not rehearsing or performing. Your days off, huh? Makes sense that fans would want to know uh, know how their heroes live from day to day. Tarashi, how would you spend the day off? Well, I make a habit of getting uh, uh, getting up bright and early so I can make some pancakes after breakfast. I take my darling puppy Chibi Chan to the park for a mid morning stroll. And then, we have lunch at Chic Cafe to rest our feet. On our way home, we do a little window shopping. After that, binge on the dramas I've got on my VCR until it's bedtime. Uh. You just described a typical girl's day. <laughs> you just described a typical girl's day! <laughs> oh. oh, sorry. That really made you sound like a fashionable young woman. <laughs> I was so surprised I got a tent. <laughs> I... I'm... I'm so scared. Oh no, Kiri-san, you shouldn't shout like that. <laughs> you made Slizzy Tehrashi cry, that's a bit much, don't you think? <laughs> oh dear! <laughs> Sh <laughs> you should say sorry. Huh? Yeah, my bad, Tehrashi. It's... <laughs> it's alright. I was just thrilled. I wasn't expecting it. <laughs> it's all... <laughs> so... Uh, about how I spend the day off. Ah, yeah, right. One thing's clear, you can't tell the fans how you really spend your free time. No, I guess not, but then, what should I say? What, what would I be doing instead? Hanging with mates. On your days off, say you spend it having fun with your friends. Having fun with my friends? That's kind of ordinary, isn't it? I mean, I already do that pretty regularly. Think about it. Punks are people, too. On their days off, even they would want to spend it with their friends. You ever notice them squatting together in parking lots? Ah, uh. oh, that's true. I see them loitering around, like you say. But are they really friends? Hmm? Oh, I used the wrong word. They're not friends. It should be mates. Mates, actually. When you put it that way, the Yankee factor goes away up. There, see? On your days off, you hang out with your mates. <laughs> Actually, you and your mates just shoot the shit with each other. Say that and you'll be fine. <laughs> I kind of get it. I'm not sure what that actually means, but hanging out with mates actually sounds like what hooligans would do. Here is some! Mm -hmm. uh, you're bad boy up, right? Uh, what's the matter? What will I say? Huh? Aku, you didn't get a topic like Tarashi? Nope. The agency told him to wing it. He's free to talk about whatever, even though even though he's practically mute. Bad by Aku has uh, even has uh, has a backstory. Locked up in juvenile reformatories from birth, Bad Boy Aku c crushed packs of punks before he even finished preschool. Mm, your agents are trying to fit a square peg in a, in a round hole. Aku's a man of few words with crazy backstory. What should he talk about to make him sound hardcore? <laughs> Don't you think it'd be better to just stay quiet? Huh? Stay, stay silent during the panel? Wouldn't a discussion about any talking be a disaster? Yeah. Nope. Aku has told he's free to talk about whenever he wants. Uh, that means he's also free not to talk at all. That's true, but... It would be worse if he were to say the wrong things and wreck his image. From Michael's backstory, I think he would seem more hardcore if he kept his mouth shut. <laughs> when you put it that way, it makes total sense. Okay, we'll do that. Bad boy Aku stays speechless during uh, during this uh. first part. Sure, Aku, are you good with that? Okay. <laughs> Alright, now we'll, we'll go over how you run this whole panel discussion. Yeah, please! Yo, Kimochi Silvas, we're almost ready for you. Uh? Oh, is it time? Uh, I mean, fine. Grah. Yikes, sorry, I mean, you can come on whenever you're ready. I'll be watching from the audience. 
Yes, please watch us. We're going to hit this hardcore Yankee thing out of the park. <laughs> We're gonna kick ass and stuff. Mm -hmm. Put your hands together for the Yokimochi Silvers! Crazy Kyosan! Bad boy Aku! Oh yeah! Whoa! Check out Crazy Kyosan's original ESP guitar! Smoke the red style! The man got the Yankee look failed! Mm. Wow! They are popular! When they're not talking, they do look like real pieces. Sopping wet high rock and roll after school, Darashika, Aku, hit it, boys! Uh, that concludes today's performance by the Yokomochi Silvers. Just listening to their songs, I can see why Yankee kids across Japan look up to Crazy Kyo's band. Now, we would like to move on to a special meet and greet panel discussion with band members. Whoa, no way! No way! Crazy Kyo sounds actually gonna talk to us. Let's throw the mantle! I can't fucking wait to hear Bad Boy Aku's voice. Here's where it gets real. They better pull this uh -huh. off. Yo, Grease Hound! We're the Yokimochi Silver, start your engines! Yeah! Crazy Kyo-san! Woo! Cool your jets, bros! But I got to hand it to Crazy Kyo-san, he knows how to rev us up and kick us into top gear, he's only fucking ace! Thanks for coming, uh, thanks for coming and rocking out to your dudes. We love you all, you romantic rebels. You punks get my pistons pumping, right there, under the hood. I love you like my turbo drive! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Good. The fans are reading it up. <laughs> Going with racing top speed off. Awesome. Thank you, Crazy Kyo-san. Next, we would like to hear from Sleezy Tarashi-san and Bad Boy Aku-san as well. First up, Sleezy Tarashi-san. Here's a question we got from a fan. How do you usually spend your days off? Huh. <laughs> I, if I get a day off, I'm missing hang out with my mates. We shoot the shit. A guy like Tarashi-san must have tons of mates. <laughs> Tarashi-san, what, what, what do you do with your mates? Really? Uh, um, we, uh, make pancakes and stuff. Huh? Oh, but we don't just stay holed up at home, we go out and eat, eat lunch at fancy cafes and stuff, yeah. Who is this guy? Uh-oh. The fans are rattled. Damn, I screwed up. I should have covered more details of Tarashi. Thank you, Sidney Tarashi-san. So, to close it out, it's time for bad boy Aku-san to say a few words. That was it? No way! He just stood there, this whole panel discussion. That's... that's... <laughs> Holy crap! Bad boy Akusan, the coolest! What a rebel! He doesn't, he doesn't play the, by the rules, other than his own rules. That's what makes him bad boy Akusan. He rules! Good. It was the right decision to not, uh, to not let the quiet Aku speak. After all, he doesn't, he doesn't take big talk to make a big man. The other did speaks louder than words. Well... It wasn't a disaster. We got two out of three to be successful. Kirisan, were you watching? Yup, I saw everything. Good work. Kirisan, we tried to apply what we learned from you about the ways of the Yankee to our <laughs> panel. The fan response was pretty damn good. I'm kind of uh. shocked. Yeah, it seemed that way. It was worth all the effort. I think we can keep the Yokomochi sewers going without sagging in popularity. Phew! Thank you very much. You got a charismatic autobiography. That was the most fun I ever had speaking in public. <laughs> Kiri-san, thanks. From, from now on, we're going to keep working hard to expand on what you taught us uh, about the way of the Yankee. We'll work on our speaking skills too. Keep an eye on us, Kiri-san. The Yokimochi Silvers are going places. Just you watch. Uh. Yeah, give it your best shot. We will! Bye! People sure have all kinds of challenges to face, at least those guys are diligent. They should survive the rough road on the entertainment world. Somehow. Don't give up, don't give up, Yokibuchi Silvas. Oh, that was fun. Um, however, you know, I'm gonna cut it here. Uh, let's go to the telephone booth real quick. Yeah. Wow, that is loud. Oh, I guess here. Yeah. Um, next time, 
We will go to the main quest. We will follow up on the lead for the Tachibana real estate thing. And uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. No, thank you. And buying out the Hakuo building that's on the Hichikufuk Street ahead there next. So yeah, if you all enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and tell me down in the comments below what you thought of all, all of it. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye bye.